some mercy is everything. Some say he's downright evil. He's got what it takes to be a legend. He's got a marvelous persona. Exposure at Sex FM. I'm John Kennedy, and that is Salem with King Knight, the title track of the debut album. And I'm very pleased to say that I have all three of Salem here huddled round one microphone. We've got Heather, Jack, and John. Welcome to Sex FM, and welcome to the UK. So you played your first show last night. How, how was it, and where was it? It was good. It was at Russian Club Studios. It's like a gallery type space. We we like it better when we're um, on a more of a stage. We were just on the ground, and the audience was right like right in front of us it's sort of weird when everybody's just like looking right at you you're like at eye level it's like unnerving or something i've been listening to the records and um the eps over the last um i guess how, how is it two years or 18 months the, oh the songs were recorded from like three years ago averaged until like a little while ago so. yeah 
And so, I, I, but I've never had the chance to see you, and I'm intrigued to know what what Salem do when you when you play live. Oh, uh, like John and I play keyboards and s sing, and <clears throat> Jack uh, raps, and he plays a drum machine in some songs. Right, and guitar too. Yeah, yeah. Well, we have to sometimes switch like positions, switch keyboards. One person goes up to the mic, and then somebody else comes back. Or we're sort of moving around a little, but it's pretty. The format of where all our, our stuff is is pretty like basic. But I, I kind of imagined that Salem really began as a as a kind of bedroom thing. And did did you ever think that you were going to take it live, or or has live performance been been part of it? Mm, we did start just like recording music and. Uh, me and Heather's place in Chicago, the three of us would always just like record music and we really had no like plan or like anything set up. Like we were just doing it and making music to for ourselves and for our friends to show to people like our friends, whatever. And then it just sort of, things just hap kept happening thing after another and like, I don't know. Yeah, because... We're planning on playing live, but we know that we do, it's cool. Yeah. How did you stumble upon this sound? It could be any way like that. A lot of times Jack will uh, make a beat and we could work off of it from there or it could start with a melody or just like, it could start from anything, yeah. any, like anything at all. No, it sounds great. The thing is that we're always making music, so it's not like we like have periods where we'll go like write songs or anything like that as much as just that we are constantly making music and like, like even when we're in totally separate places. Like, I'll be sending John things, and, like, he'll be messing with them, and then send them back. And, like, so it's just a constant process. You know what I mean? So, yeah. Like, then even when this album came all together, it was, like, taking, like, a sample out of, like, this huge spectrum of things that we've been making for ourselves, and then, like, like curating it to show it to someone else. What do you love about this city? Uh... I don't know, I, like... Like, there's, like, everything, like, that's in any city is here, but at the same time, it's, like, it doesn't feel like someone's, like, looking over your back. Like, no one really cares what you do, like they do <laughs> in, like, you know what I mean? It's just, you have your space, but you're also, like, yeah. around people, so. For young musicians like you guys, what is great about uh, being here, working yeah, here? A lot of spare time, man. Yeah. <laughs> Straight up. I mean... I don't know. I don't know what to do when I'm in Chicago, so I just like make music and shit. Like, yeah. if I knew what to do, you know, there's a lot less distractions <laughs> than like yeah. from New York and stuff. Yeah. When I'm there, it's like hard for me to turn my head off. Yeah. But when I'm here, it's like, what the fuck else am I supposed to do? Like, I could be in this field or I could work on music. <laughs> dark or anything we just like to I mean we make things that we think are we that you know are like beautiful we try to make beautiful songs and I feel like if you looked at like someone's whole life like there would be a lot of parts of it that you could say were dark or like whatever but 
it's like a product of experiences that and our like selves so whatever's coming out yeah, music is, is a, music is a product of like experience i feel like so, sometimes people like draw influences from you know like really severely like noticeable like sounds and i feel like when we are influenced by music um that we listen to or whatever it's like uh a really particular aspect of it that's like right. really that we're really interested in and we sort of bring it a little bit into what we're doing but I mean our music is really uh, just something that we do it's not so much based off other music I mean even like like a snare hit or like something from like a rap song like will be like that's yeah. really nice that's like a really nice so like we're taking from that genre in the sense of like that noise but then it could be like a drone or like a dirge or something that's like more like Indian or anything influenced. So I don't know. I mean, but I think that the thing that's nice is that what like ties it all together is that there's like the same feeling of like an experience of just like, of like, you know, sad and like other experiences and like just our response to things. We have mixed feelings about performing live. Um a lot of times we like we say that we like recording music more than we like performing live, but that doesn't mean that performing live is like something we don't want to do. I mean, we just want to like if we do anything, we like want to do it exactly like to our like aesthetic and like make it like a really comprehensive like experience, and it, not just like getting up on a stage and like playing an instrument and then like going away. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, if even if nobody had heard it now or ever, I don't think I would care. Like would and either way, like we would still be doing just what, exactly what we were doing now. Uh, okay, this is a funny one. Do your parents like your music? Yeah. 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 They listen to what you guys do, and they say we like this, we don't like this. Yeah. It's not so much like that. They're just like they give us advice. Yeah. Or they say like this. This thing you did here is nice. Or, it's not so much like black guidance. and white, yeah, sort of. Cool. Uh, so it's like your part and your part and your part and each of it, like it's kind of similar, but like kind of different. Like how would you describe Sam? Uh, I don't know. I mean, I think the part of the mythos or whatever comes from uh, like that what we're doing isn't like similar to like other things. Yeah. So it's Definitely. hard to describe. It's like it's hard to use like a comparison or something. So, I don't really know. I mean, people have been like calling our music like drag, stuff like that, but I don't know if there necessarily is like a word to say. It's like, it's, it's, I don't think it is. I think that um, I say that's like sort of a lot, but I think it's, it's not really like, like, it's not really like that. It's not really like this person, this yeah, person, I, this person. I don't like, think. all the songs are all three of us. Yeah. Yeah. So you see it more as a collection. It's just sometimes. Raps, sometimes she sings, sometimes I sing, but it's like really all the same thing. I agree, like, I wouldn't want to see it. Maybe I like it raw. Maybe I like it raw. Maybe I like it raw. Damn. Okay. Okay. Bye, Furman. Williamsburg Orange, yeah, yeah. round town like OJ Sturman. Ugh. Not current, I'm just choking. Car stand still, but the rim still going. I'm flexing, 08 Lexus. So much ice, you would think I'm Wayne Gretzky. Do hostess, do the phone necklace. All the loud, but your girl just missed me. She thirsty, bubble cush musty. Rap game easy, but the dope game shiesty. Not like me.
Homer sees everything. Some say he's downright evil. He's got what it takes to be a legend. He's got a marvelous persona.
hundred bucks a shirt. Did they like, teach you little dick and everything? Yeah. What kind of things did you call them? Just like <laughs> little dick, worthless. That like you were born to serve me. Like your life means absolutely nothing. Like you work for me now. Give me your money. <laughs> like stuff like that. <laughs> what do you think about financial domination? I remember I used to meet up with this guy at an ATM machine. <gasps> yeah, and then Ugh, he'd, he'd put in his card. He'd put in his card. He'd put in his pen, and then he'd like step aside, and then I would take out as much as I wanted, and then I would just be like, "Hey, bye." <laughs> oh my god! Yeah, it was like such a fantasy. What a rush! I know. I How know. much did you get from him? In total, yeah, uh, oh, I don't even know. Or but, like when you got to enter in a number. Um, I mean, I was never like that cruel. Yeah. Because I did want him to come back, so it would always be maybe like seven hundred or eight hundred. That's sick. Like that.
shout out to the competition I'm screaming fuck the opposition Three fifty eight, I made that shit. They sent some shots, I ate that shit. Chief Ralph in the trap and shit. I hope the cops don't raid that bitch. Leroy said, bro, name and shit. Now he wish he ain't say that shit. I ain't trying to save a bitch. I ain't got on no cape and shit. Her said, we just copy them and shit. Talking about we try and copy them and shit. How the fuck got a win? Bro, I don't know if this gonna make you feel better, bro. I remember my nose broken so many motherfucking times, bro. I don't even have nothing left in there, bro. It's just a little mush pile, bro. Look. But I'm still here in the field. They ain't soft shit. They ain't soft shit. They Yeah, man. 
NFT, come on, here where we dwell. I'm just a hangin', cause the league of spankin'. All these shady bitches, even though you know we sweet, I ain't Yes, 
if I love her I say I can't feel it She asked if I want her I say I don't need it Who, 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 who did you come with? And who would you live with? I don't give a fuck about that money or nothing I can't feel my heart but it's beating for something I can't feel my heart but it's beating for something I don't like your body but I say I can't feel it I hate it, I hate it Wake it cold nice and sweaty I hate it, I ain't never learning from lessons I hate it, I should've died on that pavement Died, died on that pavement Died, died, died on that pavement Fucking God, I need to fucking leave. Why they all on me? I can't fucking breathe. What you really need and how they wanna be? Maybe play the chase, why they all for me? Any time the sun gon' rise up, they gon' miss you. No chance to find you and your mama can't kiss you. All I'm on the news, cause they say they can't get you. Walmart parking lot. To forget you, no chance to find you when your mama can't kiss you. All the news, cause they say they can't get you. Walmart parking lot, post to forget you. I be saying, go, go, just go. go. <laughs>